Hey guys, Daniel Lang here. Uh, finally got around to do video. Um, a few things I want to get off my chest, and a few things I don't. Um, basically, it's what's been bugging me in the past few weeks and the past, like, years uh, well basically it's about my uh, life uh, some positive and some negative um, it's probably gonna be negative let's all be honest here um, so, uh, my life wasn't always happy, like, it was happy up until grade 7, um, it all started, uh, one morning, I missed my bus, and my mom was at work, and, um, my dad had to drive me into school, and he wasn't happy, as you probably could imagine. But uh, as a 12 year old at the time, I think I was 12. Whatever what grade you're in when you're 12, probably grade seven. Um, it all started, as I said already, I missed the bus and my dad wasn't happy and uh, I'm not gonna get so much detail because that'll look really bad and even though I hate my dad and my dad hates me I'm not gonna get into it because some of you may who lives in Ontario some of you might live in Ontario and like hey this guy's getting abused over whatever well this happened a long time ago um, so what happened was I missed the bus and my dad was yelling at me and all that stuff and sorry I had to pause for a minute Anyways, sorry there was someone there and I really don't want them to think I'm talking to myself. Practically am. Anyways, uh, he was yelling at me on my way to school and um, he uh, did something on the way, like a, like a violent thing. And I got to school and um, didn't say a word or anything like that and the bell rang to go in because you know we have to wait outside before we can go in so that way the teachers are ready for teaching um but then the next day uh i believe it was the next day i don't know what day it was when this happened but um i was dumb enough to uh talk about tattoos I don't know why I was talking about tattoos but uh, the EA said Daniel can we have a chat with you and I was like oh crap at the time I didn't swear I wish I was not in that stage now but you know life changes and well um, they asked me to see my arm So I showed them my one arm that did had the bruise on it. They're, they said the other arm, and I was like, oh crap. Uh, what probably got away is me rubbing it like that. That's because it was on this arm. I was probably rubbing it, and they were suspicious on it. So I showed them that arm. They asked me how I got that. And don't judge me for this, but it was last, mu last minute, and... So I didn't have a good live made up. So uh, you're probably going to laugh why I laughed about. <laughs> I'm laughing now just from thinking of it. I said I fell off the piano stool. That wasn't believable. So they got the children inside involved. They got the police involved. And I ended up going to the police station. And I got pinched on the stomach. And I got punched on the arm. 
And they questioned me and I saw this cop and I was like, oh crap, I can't lie to the police because that's illegal because it's basically protecting the um, convict or whatever. So I told them what happened and they took me, the children's side took me to the police station and took pictures of my injuries and then I got back, they told me not to say a word about this. I was like, well, they're gonna, he's gonna find out regardless if I don't say a word or not. Anyway, so, um, yeah, uh, my dad eventually found out, got mad at me, I had to tell him, I had to rat on him, because, you know, I don't want to go to jail, well, actually, I won't be, I will be going to juvie, because at the time I was 12, but, um, yeah, so, that, that's what happened, and, he got taken away and uh, he wasn't allowed to have any contact with me and all that uh, so that's the end of part one because you know I have like the limit of time I have on this video is 7 minutes and 23 seconds I had to delete some shit after I done this but uh yeah that's that's what happened uh, you probably will dislike this video, and I don't doubt you. I was, like, not so keen of telling you people this, but it still bugs me. Even though it happened back in 2012, 2000 or whatever what the year was. So, uh, so um, yeah. Uh, yeah, peace.